November 23rd. Helen and Dance and I got back to the Pridwin earlier than expected, and we didn't need to make camp. By sticking to the coastline directly rather than taking the road, we were able to cut a couple hours off our journey, and made it back just after midnight. It was too late to report in with Elder Maxon by then, so that's the first thing I need to do today. Our mission was a success. And while it was definitely one of the most terrifying and craziest things I have ever done, I must say I feel pretty good about it. Because we all came out alive, with nothing more than a couple bumps and bruises. Can't say the same for those mutants, good riddance. I couldn't sleep last night, though. Not because of the battle at the fort, but because I couldn't stop thinking about that poor family. I understand what they're going through, having a missing loved one. But that man knows where his wife is and can't get to her. I would give anything to know where Sean is, and to have some power-armored people show up at my door and promise to get him back for me. I can't let that family down. And Dance agrees. He wants to help them just as much as I do. But he says we have to report in first. So here we are. I just hope Elder Maxim doesn't have any new orders for us right away. Okay. Dance, I'm finished. Sorry. I, I just... I have to have my little routine in the morning or I just... I'm cranky in the... <laughs> anyway. Alright, ready to report to Elder Maxon. So, uh, now we just need to find Elder Maxon. Let's see. Where could he be? In his quarters, maybe? I, I you mean, think the Commonwealth looks bad? You should see the capital wasteland. Uh, uh, dog meat. I wasn't gonna... Dog meat? You shouldn't go into the Elder's quarters without permission. <sighs> you get out of there. Well, he's obviously not in there, so let's go look for him on the command deck. Ah, there he is. Okay. Stay out of his way, please, Dogman. I don't want you getting kicked off. <sighs> Elder, we're here to report. Outstanding work at Fort Strong, soldier. Thank you. Thank you. Um, what happens at Fort Strong now, actually? Paladin Dance is supervising the transfer of the Fat Man Warheads to the Prudwood. Mm. They'll provide quite an edge to our arsenal. I've also ordered a detachment to occupy the location, and use it as a staging area to protect the eastern side of the airport. All in all, you handed us quite a valuable location. Well, it... <laughs> it was an honor killing super mutants for sure <laughs> I'm glad you feel that way because our mission here has only just begun in order to bring the Institute to its knees we need to use every weapon at our disposal I try to supply my soldiers with the best that's why I'm giving you these signal grenades can call a vertebrate to your location when you need aerial transport oh simply throw one to the ground and the vertebrate will hone in on the unique electromagnetic smoke it emits once you're aboard Use the map on your pit boy to interface with the pilot's navigation system. Neat. So he'll be able to take you wherever you need. Well, that's... that's really neat. And, and can I get more of these if they run out? I'd use the supply I gave you sparingly. These devices are far more complex mm. than a standard smoke grenade. Should you need more, you should acquire them from Proctor Teagan. Okay. Okay. Thank you, Elder. That is... I will make good use of these. <laughs> I expect that you will. Now, I'm sure you're aware that Fort Strong was simply the first step towards the liberation of the Commonwealth. An even greater task lies ahead. By now, I'm sure you've deduced that our arrival in the Commonwealth wasn't coincidental. We're here because of a unique energy reading recorded by Paladin Dance's recon team. According to our scribes, the reading indicated a level of technology that only the Institute could achieve. The hmm. moment this information came to light, our mission became clear. The Institute and everyone responsible for the creation of the synths must be eliminated at all costs. Okay. To accomplish this goal, 
We need to locate the Institute's headquarters. I've had our scribes meticulously searching the Commonwealth, but they've come up empty-handed. Huh. So... So then where would I start? I want you to get out there and become our eyes and ears on the ground. You seem to have a vested interest in locating the Institute before we met, so I'm confident you'll travel in the right circles. Hmm. If you discover a way in, I need you to report it to me immediately. Any questions, Knight? Aren't, aren't there pre-war records about the Institute that might help us? I mean, I'm, I'm assuming that they were pre-war, or else how did they get so advanced? Our records indicate that the Institute was born from the remnants of a pre-war educational facility, the Commonwealth Institute of Technology. Really? The ruins of the facility are at the center of the city. Yeah, I know. But we've already searched them thoroughly. Hmm. The location appears to have been abandoned long ago. Okay. So it appears that the trail ends there. Anything else, Knight? <sighs> I guess you don't have any suggestions for where I should look, right? All I can suggest is that you keep your eyes and ears open, Knight. We have every available scribe working on a way into the Institute. It's only a matter of time before a method presents itself. Okay. All right. Reactor at 100% efficiency. If you have a moment, there's something I'd like to discuss with you. With me? Um, I'm assuming you want to do it later, mate. <laughs> Very well. It can wait. I mean, just... I mean, I don't know what it is you Engine want to discuss. At I, 87% efficiency. I just... Uh, we probably shouldn't discuss it in front of Maxim. I mean, I'm, I'm, I'm assuming. Dance, if you want to... Talk, we can talk. I. I mean, I, I didn't mean to be rude or anything. I just didn't think. Dance. Need something? You. Did you want to. Do you want to have that talk now? Yeah. D does it have anything to do with the Brotherhood? I wouldn't necessarily say that. This isn't a formal meeting. I simply want to clear the air. I think we may have gotten off on the wrong foot when we first met, and I feel like I owe you an apology. Expecting you to embrace the standards of the Brotherhood without having a history with us was unfair. And oh. given that you've adjusted so well to our beliefs, I don't think I needed to push so hard. Yeah, well, thank you. I appreciate it. Well, you deserve it. When I was an initiate, my sponsor was Paladin Creed, toughest squad leader I ever served with. He was a model soldier, embodying the values every trainee was striving to achieve. Hmm. Fiercely loyal secure in his beliefs and brave to a fault. From the moment I was assigned to his squad, I was singled out. It felt like he was pushing me harder than the rest of the team. I fought by his side for years, and we had some seriously close calls. But he never explained to me why I was treated that way. Hmm. Did you ever ask him why? I'd considered it. But unfortunately, I never had the chance. After I was promoted to Paladin, and I had moved on to my own squad. I received word that Krieg was killed at Adams Air Force Base. Oh. The news was like being kicked in the stomach. I mean, I'd lost some of my brothers and sisters before, but his death. Yeah. Well, it really got to me. It's taken me a long time to realize it. But the reason Krieg was so tough on me is the same reason I'm so tough on you. It's because I believe in you. And I don't want to see any of your potential go to waste. I think you dance. I... I don't know what to say. You don't have to say anything. Just keep doing what you're doing. Well, I've said what I had to say, and I hope that it meant something to you. I trust you'll keep this in confidence, of course. Oh. Some of that information was of a personal nature. Of... Well, I'd like to keep it that way. Of course. No. <laughs> of course, no problem. Hmm. Okay. Well. He didn't give us any more orders. What well, other than to just scour the Commonwealth, which... That's a tall order. I mean, that's a lot of ground to cover. Wow. <laughs> this is going to take a while. Um, but we could go... Paladin... Can we go try to rescue that woman now? Absolutely. 
Thank array you. Keep the array. Um, gonna try to filter it out. I need to, Minimum before we leave, damage. though, I need to sell some stuff to, oh um, Proctor Teagan. And, because I brought back that missile launcher and some other things. So. That farm's nothing you can't handle. Oh, I know. I I haven't had a chance to go to the farm. That's right, the farm. I will. I will do that. But for now, I need to uh, do some trading with you. Sure, I've got something that'll put a smile on your face. Maybe I can give you something, too, huh? Well, not give it. Sell it. Yes? All right. Thank you, Proctor Teagan. Great. I, huh, I was able to... Dog me. Dance go. Well, I was able to sell him um, those th the things that we picked up, and also a lot of. Oh, there you are. I I got some caps. <laughs> got more caps, so that's cool. Um, so we should get going. Um, I suppose we could take a vertebird. Over to where our vertebrates oh. should give us the air superiority we need yes. to win this war. We don't have to walk through the city. We could just take a vertebrate. Oh, I'm yes, I'm happy about this. Uh hi. Yes. Uh let's um excuse excuse me. Let's go. Uh take a vertebrate over towards closer to where this woman's being held hostage and then we might actually get there in time. About. Glad to have you on the team. Am I ever gonna not? I mean, I guess I haven't been here very long, but it's like I guess there's still people who haven't met me. <laughs> I just um. So yeah, let's go. Get from above. It's the only way to fly. <laughs> All right. All right. So um. We're supposed to interface the pit boy with this. So, where should we land? I don't know if there's any good places to land over here. I guess we'll just let's go. go. Oh. oh my gosh! All weapon systems are go. Good shooting night. Yeah. <sighs> I don't know if I'm ever going to get used to that sudden drop. It's pretty insane. I'm glad you don't seem to mind, boy. You do pretty good. Oh my gosh, there's a super mutant down there. No, oh, I don't think I hit him. It's not really our mission right now, is he? Wow, whoa, whoa! You are cutting it really close to these buildings, pilot! Uh huh. Give me a heart attack or something. <sighs> Hotshot pilots. Gosh. <sighs> Maybe it would have been better to walk. <laughs> but it would have taken all day, if not longer, to get over here. <sighs> okay, so the... The place where we need to find this woman is somewhere down there in one of those buildings. It's... can't really tell from up here. It's one of those. Backstreet Apparel. Man, whoa, 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 okay. I've been there before I was... I went there before... before the war. than what you've already put me through. Thanks. 
Okay. So we got a little ways to walk, but definitely not as far as we did. Um, I think I want my pistol for now. Oh, bad weather. Okay. I hope we're not too late. I really hope we aren't. Can I let him dance? Can I let him dance? Paladin? Where'd you go? What? Paladin dance? Okay. Soldier. Ugh. What's the matter? I thought you were playing a cruel joke on me. <laughs> Sorry. You just disappeared. I apologize for that. Okay. Anyways, we're, uh. Yeah, I just hope we're not too late. The. the now the man said they would be holding her for ransom for a few days. That they he only had a few days to pay them, or they would kill her. So, I'm hoping that we have a few days before they do that. Actually, Does he keep stopping to look at stuff. Paladin dance. Yes. Oh. <laughs> Sorry, I didn't know you passed me. Sorry. All right. Um, it's right on the waterfront. But I don't know what else can be right on the waterfront, too. Right? Uh, okay, so we've got people. Um, I think this is it. Those are the people. Those are the people I think we came after. Okay, I don't think he heard me. Nothing there now. What do you think? Oh no, there's two of them. Not good. Can I get a little closer? Talk me. These raiders? These are the guys that that took her captive. Oh, this one right there. This is it right here. Peekaboo! Uh oh. No, oh, no! Oh, no! Don't you shoot my dog! I don't think we're alone. No, I don't. We're not alone. Oh, okay. Thank you. <laughs> Alright. I'm pretty sure they're gonna have more inside. These are probably just the guards. Let's Good work. Do Don't leave anything behind. Yeah. I thought I saw a turret up on the on the, the roof there. Maybe if we sneak underneath it, it won't be able to see us. Okay. Alright, here we go, huh? Be ready for anything. <sighs> More stories like that? How much time you got? <laughs> yeah, I have oh, a few. Okay, this is not Let good. me see. A couple years back, before I met Clutch, 
Me and a couple friends found a young kid on the north side of the Charles. We don't have to he wasn't back. Oh, around 18 or so. Anyway, after hanging out with him for a while, it started to get dark, so I built a fire. I kid you not. As soon as I lit the first match, the kid screams, What are you doing? And knocks the match out of my hand. Oh, my you gosh, knocked so the much. match out of your hand? Why'd he do that? I'm telling a story. So, yeah, he knocks the match out of my hand. Okay. I was so surprised that I swung I and broke his nose. I should he probably said he was shoot sorry. him. And get this. When he said he was afraid of fire. <laughs> when they don't know that we're here. He was afraid of fire? I just told you he was afraid of okay. fire. You keep okay. interrupting me. It's irritating. You're irritating. As soon as he told me. You killed her! <laughs> I did it. Oh. Okay. What's the matter? I know they are bad people. I just don't like doing it. I don't like it at all. All right. Shh. We better be quiet. There might be more. I hear. Is that? Oh no. Uh, there's a turret here. I wonder if shooting it would disable it. I don't know how else to get around it. I mean, I'm assuming we don't. They don't, they don't have her. Dance! Oh! What the? Okay, shooting it, yes. But I think they might have heard that. <laughs> okay. Uh, they probably have her upstairs. Or at least in another room. This, huh? Disappearing act, huh? Okay. We, uh,. Need to be very, very careful. There's at least two other ones in here. Oh, God. sorry, you just startled me. No need to hide. It'll all be over soon. I just need a. Oh yeah, okay, another stim pack. I was running really low on stim packs after that fight with the mutants, so I'm glad. No sign of them now. I like it. Hey, let's go eat. I'm starving. You can eat when I'm damn sure we're not about to get jumped. <sighs> Jesus. You always were a fucking hard ass. That's why I'm still alive. And since I've got to rely okay. on your sorry ass to watch my oh, back, these are dressing that's rooms. trying to keep you alive, too. Enough yapping already. Somebody could be sneaking up on us right now. Whatever you say, boss. She is not wrong. So they're going to be on the alert. second and clobber us. Okay. I think one's in this room, but one could be in there or up the stairs. Think they're still out there? <gasps> nope. All quiet. One's I think it's over. Dumbass. Be glad you've got me around to watch your back. Okay. Ain't personal, just you or me. 
Okay, okay. Oh, oh, okay. There were two people in here. There's still another one. There's still another one. <sighs> all right, all right, all right, all right. Sorry, I thought we were gonna fall back. Oh, man, come back! I was having fun. <sighs> okay. Oh, I hope they don't hurt her. Well, I hope they don't hurt her. Oh no, just stand back. That's good, that's good. Oh, I know you're here. I'll find you. <sighs> okay. I don't think anybody's in those bathrooms. I think she's upstairs. Come on out. I'll make it nice and quick. You can trust me. Still more stairs. Come on, dog meat. Oh, there, here she comes, here she comes. Dog meat. Go over there. Go get go up there. Go up there. Get her. Go get her. Damn. Lost him. Threat neutralized. Oh, dance. You are a quick shot. You are a quick shot. My gosh. I didn't have time to. This is bullshit. You never know what you'll find. <gasps> There's another one. How many of these people are there? Um. She comes. <sighs> okay. I got her. Oh. Hmm. <sighs> Everything's starting to sound like footsteps these days. <laughs> what about gunfire? Payback time, boogeyman! Dance! Okay. Oh! Now we do it in the Brotherhood. <laughs> okay. Is there a woman here? I don't see the woman. Oh, there's still more stairs going up. Ugh. Let's go. <sighs> Let's be careful, though. There could still be more. Oh. Well, that probably goes onto the roof. Do you think they would have had her on the roof? I... I don't... I don't see her anywhere here. Do, is she here? There's... Oh no. What if she's not here anymore? Maybe they ha maybe they did have her down here. Maybe she's in one of these rooms. Huh. Paladin, um... I don't know what to think. Okay, I she's not here. 
she's not in any of these rooms. Oh no. This, this door is locked. Just, well, maybe she's in here. Okay, well, let's see if I can get kick it down. Gosh, it's a tough door. Come on! Ow! Don't worry, we're here to rescue you. Oh my god, thank you. Let's go. Yeah, your husband sent us. He told us where you were. Okay. Oh man, my foot hurts. All right, don't worry, we killed everybody in the building. Okay, but before we leave, I would like to uh, take a look around and see if there's anything useful that we might want to take out of here. Because I'm not coming back again. So, I remember seeing a few things up here that may be in here too. Okay. Um, I don't know. Let's see. I, I did want to grab to these you, that doesn't seem fans. Right. To me, it's an archaeological relic. Wow, look at this typewriter. It looks brand new. Huh. I wonder if it still works. I should take that one back to uh, the um, sanctuary. Actually, now that I think about it, um, I could go back to sanctuary, couldn't I? I mean, the... Ooh, dog meat? I got your dinner. I got your dinner, boy. A couple of them. Nice. Huh! Crognack the Barbarian! <sighs> Nate loved this magazine. He had a subscription for it. sanctuary now. I didn't feel like we could before. Like, I felt like we were obligated to stay, you know, on the Pridwin and, I mean, we were. We were obligated to do that. Um, but now, Elder Maxon has not given us any new orders other than to go search the Commonwealth for, for the Institute, which is a pretty open-ended job. I, sorry, I'm just talking to myself. Let's go. We still have a long way back to your house, and it's not going to be easy. I'm pretty sure. I almost forgot about the turrets. Uh, okay, we should probably destroy it, don't you think? Just so it doesn't shoot anybody that's walking by. Safety's off. Oh, darn it. Oh. Thank you, sir. I appreciate that. What do you got there, boy? Oh. Mm. Okay. Excuse me, Paladin. Ooh. Oops. I didn't want all of this stuff. I don't know what I got from him, but what? Hmm. 
Wow. That's kind of nice. It takes the same bullets as my other one, only it's smaller. Huh. Okay, well, um, we should probably... We can't cross here. Let me... Let me just take a look at my map real quick. There's a lot of bridges to choose from. I don't know if we should walk down this side of the river or that side. I already have walked down this side, so maybe... I mean, I kind of know what it's got going for it. Oh, wait, there was some weird, creepy critters over there, if I remember right. Maybe we should walk down this side and take this bridge over. Or any of these bridges, and we can head on over this way. Okay. Right, don't you think? It's getting late, though. We might need to... We might need to think about finding a place to camp soon. Because I'm pretty sure we're not going to make it all the way there before dark. I mean, we've got, you know, less than an hour of daylight left as it is. And it feels like... Hold up. Paladin? What's up? I think we've got mutants up ahead. That's not good. He's right where we need to go, too. Not good. Maybe we could kill him. I mean, it's not like we haven't done it before, right? Looks like there's only one. Well, who knows? There could be more. Ready? Ready. All right, here we go. Oh, I did not kill him. I did not. Oh no! What does he have? Must be my imagination. Back it in, boys. Oh no! Something out there. Oh no! I think he has a missile launcher. Paladin. Oh, I did it, I did it, I did it. Alright. Look, look. Alright, I drank all of my other ones. Let's take these, we can share them. Was that all of them? Looks like it might have been it. Alright, lady, I think the coast is clear now. You can come along with us. I think. Oh. Oh, it stinks. Oh my gosh. Alright, we definitely need to start finding a place to stay for the night. I don't know if there's any safe places, though. Hold up, we got lights. Is she coming? Looks like we got lights here. Okay. There's people. Is she coming? They don't look like raiders. Huh. No, those are not, unless raiders like to... I have not seen any raiders that just are wearing normal clothes. And I am concerned about her. She's not coming. Lady? I don't even know her name. 
Lady, are you... You shouldn't hang back so far. Where'd she go? It is dark. It is dark, dark. There she is. Ma'am? You need to follow us. We, we've cleared the way. Ma'am? I'm hoping if we put our minds to it, we can help turn this place around. Well, I hope so, too. <sighs> I wonder if we shouldn't just camp here. I, it's probably not very safe. I mean, it's right on the road. Oh, hey, maybe we can camp under the bridge right here. I mean, it's not ideal, but we could take turns keeping watch. That might be better than continuing in the dark. What do you think, Paladin? Yeah. I suppose you're right. All right. Let's do that then. It's clear tonight. We should be able to spot any hostiles at a decent range. That's good. Because it doesn't feel very safe here at all. Oh, but I am so tired out. Would you mind if I take second watch shift um, tonight, Paladin? I don't know if I'm going to be able to keep my eyes open right now. Ah, all right. Thanks. There is some food in my bag if you're hungry, though. Oh, and if you get bored, I've got that Grognak the Barbarian in there, too. And a, and a couple other comics as well. Comic books? I thought they were a waste of time. Well, unless you all you've got is time to kill. Oh, my goodness. I am tired. Okay, I'm going to go to sleep. Um, so, good night, everyone.